thousands of public transport drivers took to the streets in Jakarta Tuesday to protest ride-sharing apps like Uber, Grab, and Gojek. These mobile apps and others have sparked cutthroat price wars in the city. Taxi drivers say they're feeling the pinch. Uber. Close Uber and grab car, please, because we're suffering loss now. The government said the app will encourage young people to use public transport. But since Grabcar and Uber came into the market, we've been facing a hard time to earn a living. It's not enough for saving. The proliferation of cheap taxis using these ride-sharing apps has made traditional taxi services unprofitable and threatens the business models of the country's top taxi firms. But for those profiting from the apps, the protests are dangerous. One motorcycle driver who works for Gojek said he was beaten by protesters. My hand phone is lost and all my stuff was lost, he said. They're criminals. The Indonesian Transportation Ministry wants the apps shut down because they're not registered as public transport. But the Communications Ministry, which oversees them, says the firms can go on operating.